Hey everybody, Dwayne Kilborn here from CoastRag.com. I'm here with Gene Petriello, Six Flags Over Georgia Properties Communication Manager. How you doing, Gene? I'm doing great. How are you? Very well. It's a great day. Uh, park's not open yet, but it actually it's nice out. Feels We're, like a day we should be yeah, open, we should right? be, It's beautiful out here We should here run the coasters right now. <laughs> Uh, we're ready to go. We don't have to worry about any uh, extra passes. We just go in right now. I have a season pass already, so we can do it. And we'd have to park two ourselves today. We would, yes. Everybody but, would be jealous. Yeah, but but looking back though, you, you haven't had a long time in the off season, right? I mean, yeah. you just the last time we spoke, we were at Holly in the Park, and before you know it, now we're sunny at least for a day, and you're gonna be opening up here next month. It's hard to believe, you know, where you are only about 28 or 30 days or so away from opening, and it's a number that keeps dwindling day by day. We're excited for the season, but yes, you're right. We had a shorter off season this year because of Holiday in the Park. We had a great Holiday in the Park season. It went till January 4th of this year. Looking forward to doing it again this coming season. But our off season was pretty much cut in half. So our maintenance teams are really, really busy and under pretty tight time restraints here to make sure that we do all the maintenance that we need to do so that our rides are safe and ready to go for our opening on March 14th in a shorter time frame. But we are taking every precaution to make sure that we're ready to go for the 14th. Yeah, definitely no cutting corners here. Otherwise, we'd be inside right now. But they're hard at work, so we're going to let them keep working. But let's speak about what we have starting in, in, in uh, March here, opening season. What do we have new? Yeah, March 14th this year for the opening of the park, we have Batman backwards. We're really excited about it. We're going to be able to take Batman, the classic ride that everyone loves. More than 16 million people have ridden Batman since it opened in 1997 here at Six Flags Over Georgia. And now we're going to have some of the first timers. They're going to ride the ride backwards. You won't see what's coming, the loops, the turns, everything that you normally see on the ride, you won't see it this year for the first few months that we are open at the park through late spring so we're really excited about the opportunity 27,000 feet of uh, 2700 feet of track backwards you know 50 miles per hour bedlam of loops and you just never know when it's coming so you don't want to just wait to the end of the season because we don't know how long this will be open it's limited time right it is so we, we have wait. an end date but we're not telling you just yet okay we want to keep that a little bit of a secret but if you go to our website you'll find out more information but for the time being you know it's a limited time only experience it's going to be in the spring okay. and of course later this spring we have two new rides opening in gotham city oh, yes. which is the joker chaos coaster and yes. harley quinn's insanity so this all kind of is tying together to have a nice spring and an exciting time here at six flags over georgia then we get into the summer and you can cool off at hurricane harbor yeah so you have gotham city lots going on there of course can't forget about the rest of the park but of course we have batman backwards and then of course all the other fun stuff and then then when does uh, Hurricane Harbor? Hurricane Harbor opens May 22nd. So it's a big day at the park because we got Batman. We'll go forward at that point. I can tell you that much. Okay. Uh, we are going to have two new rides. We're going to have the Joker Chaos Coaster and Harley Quinn and Hurricane Harbor all ready to go for the first day of daily operations on May 22nd. Wow. So you're going to be going backwards and then later you're going to be going forward. Yeah. So, so you better not miss out on that. So you can ride Batman twice this year and get two different types of experiences. You get your backwards, Batman the ride backwards in the spring, and in the summer, Batman the ride forward the way it normally goes that many people have ridden before. Now, Flash, Flash Pass will be available for Batman? Be available for Batman, and also just found out yesterday breaking news. Oh, yes. So I'm telling breaking you, breaking news right news here. Right here. <laughs> uh, the Joker Chaos Coaster and Harley Quinn Spin Sanity will also have the Flash Pass this year. Wow, so keep that in mind, everybody, because you know some of these have limited uh, capacity, some of these have limited time, so you want to make sure you utilize your time uh, in the park the best you can. Absolutely. Right? Okay, and then anything else going on? Anything new? Well, we have a couple other projects going on in the park. Obviously, we're doing, as I talked to you earlier, about our off season maintenance. Yes. Everyone thinks about the rides, but we're also looking at the buildings. We're doing some painting in the park. Okay. You're going to see some aesthetic things that are new in the park. It's going to look a lot brighter this year in the park and really trying to liven up and get that fun experience and continue the momentum that we built last year because we had an incredible 2014 season and we're looking forward to having an even better 2015 season. Perfect. Now, one last thing. What's the current status of Batman? Are, are, is it ready to run right now? Can we, can we jump on it? Can't jump on it. There's not even a train on this coaster right now. And let's let's put everything to bed here. Two trains, both going backwards both. at the beginning of the year. Not Everyone the same asks. time. Though. Well, not the same one, time. Yeah, the, one be on the train. One will be on the track, the other will be loading. loading. <laughs> okay, good, good. But, you know, we're having two trains, and yes, both will be going backwards. There will be no guessing of am I on the backward train or the forward train. Both going yeah. backwards. That would so be that's really good bad news. for the line. We will be just yeah. singing. Yeah, so we don't want to deal with that. You don't want to deal with that. Place. They're both going backwards uh, during this time when Batman the Ride is backwards. But the train, yes, it's off the track behind us right now and is back in our maintenance shops. And we are working to turn the train around. And that is how we'll get it backwards, put it back on the track, and then be ready to go. Perfect. For March 14th. March 14th. Well, you heard it right here. You have Batman backwards. And later on in the season, we'll have Batman forwards. So don't miss out on both of those opportunities. We have lots of new attractions and some new updates. You guys will probably unveil in the next couple of weeks and as we yep. get into the season. 
So there you have it. So everybody, come out to Six Flags Over Georgia. Experience it in the spring, yeah. March 14th opening day. Yeah. Don't want to be late. Get here early. Get here early. Very early. Make sure you're early, especially for Batman. You know, people this year, I think what's going to happen in the beginning of the season is people are just going to run down to Batman yes. because we put up a Facebook post the other day yes. about asking what's your thing you're looking forward to the most about the park this year. 75%, and that's just a rough estimate from what I've seen, have said Batman the ride backwards. Yes. So when 75% of over 2,500 people tell us that, that's a lot of people, and that's just a small glimpse of what we're going to have this spring. So get to the park early. You might want to come to Batman first, or you could be smart and come to Batman yeah. later <laughs> in the day and spend the whole day at the park. Do everything else. And do yes. the end of it. Do that at well, the end of the day. I do well. know. I'm glad you guys are having Batman backwards because some of the other Six Flags have had that opportunity, and we get that here in Georgia, so I don't have to worry about traveling all over the place just to get that experience in. So that's awesome. And I think uh, I'm going to take off here and head straight to the gym to get my cardio up so I can run from the front gate all the way to Batman on first day so I can try to be in front line and then go enjoy the rest of the park. Yeah, you'll be uh, probably more in shape than me. Well, I, uh, we'll see. We'll see. I, I, we, and you don't, you can't run through the park though. No. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I will walk very fast through the park. And you don't want our security officers to tell you to slow down. Yes, we don't want that there. You know, you can do speed walking like in the Olympics. Yeah, speed walk. Yeah. Yes. I can speed, so you got to go on a treadmill walk. and learn to speed walk. Yes, I'm going to get a speed walking coach and I'm going to walk from the front to the back as fast as I can. So uh, you guys get behind me and we'll, we'll go ride the ride. Thanks for your time, Gene. Yep, thanks for coming out. And Appreciate we'll it. We'll see you. In, can you believe it's like a month from this Saturday? Wow. The 14th. And you know, February and March line up exactly together. Exactly. So it's one month from Saturday, exactly 28 days. Jeez. Wow. So hurry up and get out there. And anyone needs to fly into Georgia, I will pick you up. Let's do it. There's an airport right across the street. <laughs>